Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's been a little while since I've talked to you. I was really sick for like three or four days with a really bad cold. It almost felt like the flu, but I didn't have the fever or like chills or anything, but I was really sick. Um, finally, I am feeling a lot better. I'm going to get my nails done in a few minutes because they're so bad and so overgrown. If you can see that, the overgrowth is really, really bad. A lot of them are chipped and it's just really time for me to get my nails done. So I think I'm gonna do like a brownie nude Nude. I've been doing bright colors, but we're finally getting a little bit chillier. I'm wearing a sweatshirt today I think it's like in the 60s like it feels like fall so I'm Going to do like a brown nude maybe for fall time And then I want to go to Bath and Body Works and get some new wallflowers because the wallflowers I have at home are like spring and summer scents So I want to get some fall scents Maybe potentially get a couple candles. We'll see. I have a 10 off of 30 coupons So I definitely want to use that and then I want to go to my P.O. box because I haven't been there in a couple of weeks And maybe I want to make something today too, like bake a sweet treat Because Michelle made cake pops and they looked so good So she kind of inspired me to bake something today. So that is the plan um, For now we're gonna go in and get my nails done. We're also gonna visit Michaela. So let's go All right, I just got my nails done I got Cabana Cove, which is a little bit more warm than I thought it looked in the bottle, but I still like it for fall. And now I'm in Bath and Body Works, gonna look at the candles and the wallflowers. So let's see, there's like a lot of new designs for the candles. I love the new packaging. Ooh, and I like these lids a lot too. This candle smells so good. Vanilla pumpkin marshmallow. I might get this, but I'm also getting the five for 23 for the wallflowers. Okay, I definitely have to get this little barn because it's so fitting because we live in a barn. So I'm definitely gonna pick up this. It is a little expensive. It's 1850, but it's so cute. And I do think it lights up too. All right, this is what I'm getting. I'm getting wallflowers, that plug-in and one candle. So I feel like I did pretty good. We have the Christmas ones out. This one's adorable. How cute is that little tree and dog? And look at this one. All these are so cute. I'm also gonna get one of these because I feel like everyone around me is super sick. So I'm gonna put this in my car and bring it with me. All right, I'm in Sephora now and I'm going to fill in my brows with the new Fenty Beauty MVP in medium brown. Because I don't do anything with my brows anymore. I literally just use, oh my God, how weird. I literally just use um, Gimme Brow through my brows. So we're gonna add some more definition. I like it, I'm so pale. I feel like that looks good. All right, so as you can see, I got some things at Bath and Body Works and Sephora, and then I went to my P.O. box and I got five packages. So I'm gonna open everything up with you guys once I get home. But now I'm in the parking lot of Target, and I'm gonna go in because we need toilet paper. And then also I might bake something, so I'm gonna look at the baking things, and maybe just like miscellaneous beauty products. And then we're going to go to Starbucks and get a pumpkin cold brew, because it's literally so delicious. I wanna start getting more into kombucha, so I think I might pick up a couple. Some of it kind of upsets my stomach, but I think that's just the apple cider vinegar, um, which I don't even see that they have. So, let me think. I know kombucha is supposed to be really good for you, but I don't know which one to pick. Pink Lady Apple. This one might be good. Power Greens. Maca Berry. This one Scott drank the other day and he liked it. But I don't think I'd like this one. Blood orange, carrot, and ginger. That might be a little much. I think I'm gonna get some fruit while I'm here. They have peaches, plums, and nectarines, which I love all three. So I think I'm gonna get one of each. All of this fruit makes me so happy. One thing that I don't like is grapefruit. I don't know why I just cannot eat grapefruit. I think it's gross. All right, I'm feeling lazy. So I think I'm just gonna get either these, the confetti ones, or probably these, which are hiding. The Reese's ones, I might get these, although they don't have any like chocolate in it. I decided just to get these because it has more chocolate than those Reese's. 
All right, so I just went into Target and I went to the beauty section first. They had so many products from this company called Verse and I saw it the other day at Target and it caught my eye just because the packaging is so pastel and pretty. So I wanted to get something but I didn't. But let me know in the comments down below if you've tried this brand out because everything looked so enticing to me. They also had a Garnier, I think it was a face mask that was on clearance. They had a lot of products that were on clearance today. And then they also had a shampoo, which again, the packaging just drew me into this shampoo. They also had a company that I just recently worked with called the Seaweed Company. And they have shampoos, conditioners, and body creams. They are based in Maine. And it was cool to see them in Target. And they also had Native deodorant. And they had a body wash from Native. And before, I think you could only get it online. But it is all natural, paraben free, sulfate free, and aluminum free. So I thought that was pretty cool as well. And then I went over to the home decor section and of course they had all new things they were just putting out but they had a ton of new blankets for the fall like cranberry and mustard colors everything looked so pretty and cozy and comfy and I really wanted to get something but I held off they were just putting things out so I'm gonna wait a couple more weeks and then I'm gonna go back to Target and see what they have but now I'm in the parking lot of Target I do have cookies in the back and hopefully they don't melt but I'm gonna go into Starbucks or go to the Starbucks drive-thru and get my pumpkin cold brew and then finally head home um, I realized that I just got sweets and I haven't eaten anything so yikes kind of want to go to Taco Bell but I shouldn't I just went to this spa where we did this water journey and it's supposed to kind of like detoxify you so I'm feeling like I'm very healthy right now I'm very like cleaned out um, and I don't really want to put Taco Bell into my body, but at the same time I do. So, you know, dilemma. But I'm definitely going to go get the pumpkin cold brew, so that can't be good for me. But YOLO, here we go. Pumpkin cold brew. Hey, Trish, what can I do for you? Hi, can I have a grande pumpkin cold brew? Sure, what can I do for you? Um, and can I have a tomato and mozzarella panini? Sure, anything else for you. That's going to be it. Thank you. Okay, I caved and I got a panini because I'm freaking so hungry. I haven't eaten anything. By the way, if you can get your hands on this lip balm from Sephora collection, it's the watermelon one. It's like five or six dollars. Oh, it's so good. It's so good and it has a tint, although I'm putting it over lipstick, so you can't really tell. Probably shouldn't put this on if I'm gonna eat and drink. Yikes. Oh well. I'm so excited for this. I feel like I've been like so tired all day. Probably dehydration to be honest. Probably should be chugging back the water instead of the coffee. We're chugging back the coffee today, okay? We need it. We're gonna go home and clean the whole barn because the barn, you guys seem to love that barn tour. It's really taking off. Um, but the barn is a disaster right now. It is literally like so messy. It's actually embarrassing. I'll show you guys, cause I don't really care. But um, there's so many dishes I need to do. So many clothes, it's just, everything is everywhere. And I'm getting a king size bed. I know, how's it gonna fit in there? I don't know. We'll make it work. But we're getting a king size bed. It's probably gonna take up the entire bedroom. But I'm so excited to not like be suffocated by Scott the whole night. The reason why I got sick is because I woke up in the middle of the night to him breathing on my face, like full on breathing sick breath on my face. And that's how I got sick. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, what you oh, thank you so much. Okay, we got the pumpkin cold brew. Yes, I live for this. I live for it. Let's take a cute little thumbnail. Mmm, this does not get old to me. The pumpkin cold brew does not get old. It's so good. Mmm, -hmm. doesn't that just look delicious? It is, I'm getting lipstick all over it, but that's okay. And I had to get the tomato and mozzarella panini because it's so good, but this is scorching hot. So we're not gonna touch that for a minute. I'm gonna sit here in the AC and eat my sandwich and then I'll talk to you guys once I get home and show you everything I got because 
I went a little crazy today. Might have spent a lot of my paycheck to be honest, but that's okay. I'll see you guys once I get home. All right, I am home now, and as you can see, this place is a disaster. Excuse me, I'm sorry I didn't get you anything. Teddy's getting groomed on Monday, cannot wait. But as you can see, very messy and cluttered. The dishes, whoa, yikes, that's, that's a problem, okay? I'm gonna have to work on that. I have my makeup all there. It's just everything is everywhere. I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up and what I got in the peel box, and then I'm gonna start cleaning. Okay, so I tried to lay out everything that I picked up today and got in my P.O. box. So first I went to Bath & Body Works and I ended up getting this candle. It is Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. I love the packaging, it's very simple, but I like that it's brown. Puffin. I like that it's brown and I don't think I have this candle. It smells really, really yummy. So I picked that up. They were $10 off. And then I got five wallflowers. So I got Cinnamon Irish Cream, Leaves, Caramel Pumpkin Swirl, pumpkin apple and pumpkin cupcake. And then I had to get this little antibacterial hand gel in pumpkin cupcake. So that smells really good. And then naturally I had to get this barn. It's a plug-in and it lights up on the windows, which is so cute. It was kind of expensive, but I needed a new one because mine were kind of burning on the top right here. So I picked that up. I also got scratch tickets because I have to, every time I go out, I have to because knock on wood, but that's not real wood. I have been pretty lucky. Um, so I got that from Bath & Body Works. Then I went to my P.O. box and I got some products from Lancome. So this was sent to me free for review from Lancome and Octoly. This is one of my favorite blushes ever. This is my second one. But it is the Blush Subtle. I don't know how to pronounce that. But it is in Shimmer Mocha Havana. And it is the prettiest natural blush. It's kind of more like a bronzy blush. And I love using this for weddings. I used to use this on brides all the time in Sephora. But this is what it looks like and it has a hint of shimmer and it's just a perfect like natural everyday blush. But I love it on brides so much. So if you can pick this up, it is so freaking beautiful. Definitely a favorite blush of mine. So I got this, I will link it down below. And then I got two more products from Lancome. I got the Tent Idol Ultra Wear. This is in the shade 260. And I've been using this. You can maybe tell mine one, the one that I've been using is right there, but this is in a different shade. I would say this is medium to full coverage. It's a very like flawless finish. And this is what the foundation looks like. Again, it's in the shade 260 Bisque N. Um, so hopefully this matches me pretty well. I think this is gonna be perfect for when I go on vacation because it's a little bit more tan. So I love this, and then also it comes with the Prep and Hydrate. So this is an illuminating, hydrating primer that goes underneath, and I have not tried this out yet. So this is what it looks like, love the packaging of it. And I'm gonna try these two together and see how I like them. But thank you to Lancome for sending that to me. I'm gonna try this combination tomorrow for work, all three of these. And then from Target, I got these Honest Wipes that I've talked to you guys about. I really do like these. I got Reese's Peanut Butter Pumpkins Snack Size. I couldn't pass these up, they're so good. And I used to not like the ones that were like shaped differently, but now I do. So I shouldn't have got them, but I can't resist Reese's. They're literally one of my favorite chocolates. Reese's and Ferrero Rocher's are so good. So I got those. And then this I got, it was only $3 in the Target like dollar section. And it's a banner that says home. And I thought that was really, really cute. So I picked that up. And then I also just got a peach, a plum, a nectarine, and toilet paper, and wipes too. So that's everything that, oh, and this, I almost forgot about this. This I received free for review from Wow, Color Wow, and Octoly, two different products. And there's a hairstylist that works kind of near me, and she had these products, and she was talking really highly about them. So this is the Dream Coat Supernatural Spray, Magically Transforms Texture, Amazing Humidity Proofing Powers. So I thought that was really cool because my hair is very, very frizzy. Like as soon as I go outside, my hair frizzes out and gets all puffy and loses its straightness or curliness. So I'm gonna try this. She said I needed it. So I'm really happy to receive this in the mail. And then the other product is the Dream Cocktail Coconut Infused. This is for dry straw-like hair. And it says it instantly renews silky fluidity. Fluidity. 
So this is what this product looks like. I'm really excited to try both of these. I feel like my hair is getting really healthy lately, so I'm gonna be trying these out and see if this works for humidity and my dry, straw-like hair. Okay, I figured I would open up my FabFitFun box because I don't really know what's in here. I've seen a couple of videos because the videos literally went out like three months ago. But this is the FabFitFun fall box. How cute. Okay, let's see what's in here, Ted's. I think I picked out a couple of things. So we have a magazine, Megan Trainer on it. Oh, yes. So I'm excited about this. The first thing is from Amika. I'll show you the inside of the box because I feel like that's more eye-catching. But I think this is a mini straightener. Ooh, it's like suede coral packaging. Oh, it's not even mini, how cute is this? Okay, it's a new straightener. What does it smell like? How cool, I'm really excited about this. So this is from Amika and it's a full size straightener. I thought I was getting a mini. This is definitely not mini, but wow, I'm really happy to have this. Yay, I feel like that made the whole box for me. Um, we have a human and kind skincare with a conscience body souffle, vegan and cruelty free. Packaging's nice. Let me see if I can smell it. Nope, it's sealed, all right. Next, we have a damage remedy. This is from Aveda. Daily hair repair, instant visible repair, protects with heat styling. Looks like I'm gonna be trying out a bunch of new hair products. So that's for a heat protectant and damage. We have an aromatherapy deep relaxed roller ball. Is this a perfume? Okay, let's smell this together. I smell nothing. Oh, I, I smell it. Definitely smells like a spa. I like it. It's strong. It is strong. Next, we have the Trestique Mini Eye Essentials Lux Neutral Set. So a brow pencil, a shadow crayon, a shadow, another shadow crayon, and an eye pencil. Little kit. We have this. This is from, I'm pretty sure it's Kate Spade. Yeah. So we got a Kate Spade bag. Super cute. So it's a polka dot. I think you could use this as like a lunch bag or any kind of bag, but it says out to lunch on it. That's adorable. Really, really cute. I, I might use that for lunch. And two more things. These I'm pretty sure I've seen in Target. This is Juice Cleanse from Harper and Ari Exfoliating Sugar Cubes. I feel like these would smell so good. Let's see. Oh my God, it smells so good. It smells like, like a fizzy drink, like a fizzy apple-y green drink. It smells good. So I got those. And then the last thing in here is the Better Skin Company Lava Magic Cleanser Scrub Mask. I like this packaging. This looks similar to this packaging, but this is what it looks like. A daily cleanser, exfoliating scrub, and mask. Interesting. All in three, huh? Hmm. Okay, so that's everything in my FabFitFun box. Definitely most excited about this hair straightener. I feel like that's so cool and I love the color of this. Um, I'll link FabFitFun down below. Video is not sponsored. I have a $10 off coupon, I think. Um, but now I'm gonna clean because this place is a disaster. Right, next, I'm going to drink the rest of my pumpkin spice and do all of these dishes. The kitchen is a disaster. So what I usually like to do when I'm cleaning is I like to set a timer and do everything as fast as I can in 10 minutes. So, hey Siri, set a timer for 10 minutes. Your timer is set for 10 minutes. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try and get as much done. See you in 10 minutes. All right, so it has been 10 minutes. My alarm's going off. Um, I did not finish everything. 
but I feel like if I had 10 more minutes, I could finish the rest of it because it's just that right there. But I washed all of those and I'm feeling good, but I think I'm gonna reset it for another 10 minutes just so I can finish it and feel good and work on the rest of the barn. That is a disaster because I really made a mess of the whole thing. This is my small collection of wallflowers and all of these are very spring and summery. Waikiki Beach Coconut, Sun Wash Citrus, Coastal Capri. I just didn't have time to like use them. Um, Harvest Gathering is pretty fall, but now we're gonna add these. Hopefully they all fit in here. Into here. And then I'll take a look after. I have three total um, plugged into my wall right now. So I'm gonna see which ones are running low and then I'll change them out for these fall ones. You guys, how cute is this home sign? I'm actually obsessed with this whole section right now. I feel like it looks so good. All right, so I finished cleaning the barn and it looks so much better. Hi, you're so cute. So this is what it's looking like. I'm just waiting for these dishes to dry and then I have a couple more dishes to do, but it's pretty much, for the most part, all clean and organized. And yeah, I'm feeling really good about it. I feel like I drank too much caffeine today. Also, we got this um, heating and AC unit finally in, so the air is on. It's 70 degrees in here and it feels so great. I don't know what you're usually supposed to set the air on, but 70 degrees feels very comfortable. It's pretty humid out today and um, this feels good. This feels like AC's kicking in and it feels nice in here finally. So I'm gonna edit this vlog though just because I'm exhausted from the day and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you all have a great weekend. Let me know if you wanna see another vlog go up on Sunday because I can definitely vlog throughout this weekend and I will see you guys then. Bye.